Hello everyone. In this video, we will be giving a brief intro about Bluebot. First, To make this bot, these components are required. First, motor drivers. It is an IC L293D which is used to control the motors. Second, Bluetooth module. Two motors, each of 150 RPM. Arduino. It is a microcontroller which is used to connect the various components of the bot. Chassis. It is the main body of the robot which we are constructing. Jumper wires, they are used for connecting various components. Wheels, Arduino software, it is an IDE which is installed on the desktop of our computers. Now coming on to the Arduino code. First of all in the setup we begin the serial communication by writing the syntax serial.begin and in the brackets 9600 which symbolizes the baud rate. The next step is to define the output pins which are as follows 9, 10, 11 and 12. And now we come on to the void loop where our program begins. In the lo void loop we come on to the if statement where first we write if serial dot available which signifies that the bluetooth module is receiving the input signals and next on to the nesting f loop where we symbolize the various statements according to which our bot moves now we upload the code on the arduino through the software installed on our computers make sure you have removed the TX and RX pins of the Bluetooth module, otherwise problems can appear on uploading the code. For power supply to Arduino, we can use either an adapter or a battery. Now open the app through which we will control our bot. In our case, we have made our own app named Bluebot using the MIT app inventor which you will be learning in the further lectures. For your convenience, you can use the RC controller app which is available on the Play Store for free. Now after opening the app, search the Bluetooth device named HC05 and generally the password of the device is 1234 for pairing. After successful connection of the module to the app, you can control your bot using the mobile phone. make your own blue bots. For any further queries, you can drop your query in the comment section on our YouTube video. Thank you.